So today is February the 3rd, and I'm going to open up this water station. First time this year. It's been covered since, oh, I guess the uh, first week of December. And uh, I've already rolled out some hay, and this is paddock 6C here. And then I've also got some hay over here in paddock 6 D. So this will be the oh, fourth, third and fourth paddocks that I'm going to be moving the cows through the month of February. The whole idea is feed them in these paddocks, let them take a half a bale of hay in each one of them spread some manure and uh, move on to the next one. We'll move through, oh, I think it's 26 paddocks like this. And uh, that'll be 13 bales of hay I have to go through. And I've got 25 in the hay shed. So I thought I would just kind of show you this. This is what they left behind back in December. And like I said, we're gonna let them start eating some of this hay I got rolled out. looky there we got some ice in there but I don't think it's very thick we'll see They're a little thicker than I thought break it up scoop it out Cold. There we go. Water's running. Okay. So we'll go up here and open this green gate and we'll see what the cows have done to the hay that I rolled out for them in this last paddock. This is paddock. 7D that we're gonna go into. All right, let's go up here and see what these cows are doing. I'm sure they'll move. All I gotta do is call them, but I just wanna see what they've done to this hay situation. Yeah. They've still got some in here. I could probably move them. They probably won't care if I do that. But you can see, they haven't quite got it all laid up, but I think, you know, for what's in here, so well, they've got pooed on. All right. Well, girls, I came over here to see if you wanted to move. Do you want to move? 
There's Ferdinand. That's uh, number 21's bull calf that she had last year, and number 21 left the farm. So he's kind of like an orphan. All right, let's go, girls. Come on. Let's go. There's Buster, the bull. Let's go, ladies. Ferdinand, I see you're in the back. Let's go, girls. There they go. I'm going to run out here and get after some of this hay, right? We haven't seen any grass growing up yet too much but it ain't gonna take too long actually if you look right here I'll get down here so you can see it you can start to see that we've got some grass that's starting to green up and grow so that's all good right So my intention is to uh, go in some of these pastures that have got a little bit of thinness to them, meaning that the grass isn't very thick or heavy on it. I'll do a little overseeding. I want to throw some clover seeds out. I got a bag of clover. Um, I'm not going to broadcast the entire one acre, so I'm just going to probably go through maybe a couple of pounds to an to an acre and just kind of spot spread it here and there try to get the, some clover in some of these I used to have some clover but I guess it exhausted itself and uh, one of last year's heifers pretty good looking girl Little long-legged, but she's not too big. That's number one eleven. That's number eleven's first heifer calf. So she's three years old this year, I guess. So body condition-wise, I think these cows are in really good shape say they're at least a five maybe a six very happy with them I'm not sure about 23 if she's bred or not but I know the rest of them are so we're in good shape at number 11 she says I think I'm gonna try some of this old grass laying in here like 411 she says you know what there's some grass in here we missed
none of this has started growing yet to speak of i'm sure if you get down in there you might find some here and there but still a little bit cold it was uh, 13 degrees here this morning so but i think this is the last cold morning for oh at least 10 maybe 12 days so maybe we're out of the coldest weather for this year or i should say this season anyway number 11 she's looking really good I'm happy with them. So this is the seventh move in our rotational bale grazing. Again, I put out a half a bale and uh, they'll stay in here for 24 hours and I've already got the other half bale in the next paddock back over here. Um, might be a little hard to see it. Let's see if I can zoom in a little bit. And if you see it, it's kind of, well, let's see. It's kind of like right in there, top of the picture. Anyway. Seventh move, got uh, 18, 19 more moves, is that right? Something like that. So, hope you enjoy this. This is how we're doing it this year. We'll see what it does. I just uh, overseeded a little bit of uh, red clover in here. Not too much, just areas that were a little bit sparse and where you can see a lot of the ground showing, I threw some seed in there. So we'll see how things go. And this here's the water station. I just opened it up hold this uh, tub off of it screw them down for the winter I think I've showed you that in other videos and I dumped a little bit of rock in here I had some left in the dump truck so I brought it up here and dumped it I probably could use about uh, three more loads just like that in here I don't think I'll get any in here this year though Well, that's my video for the day.